To write the formula for lead 4 phosphate, we go to the periodic table, look up lead, that has an element symbol of Pb. And phosphate, that's not on the periodic table, it ends in ATE, it's a polyatomic ion. So either you have it memorized, or you look it up on a table of common polyatomic ions. Either way, phosphate is PO4, 3 minus. Lead's a metal, phosphate, that's a nonmetal, a group of nonmetals. So when we have a metal and some nonmetals, we have an ionic compound. We need to think about the charge on the lead and then the phosphate. Lead, it tells us right here, that has an ionic charge of 4 plus. We know the phosphate is 3 minus. And we need to have these add up to 0 to give us a net charge of 0, since lead 4 phosphate, that's a neutral compound. We can do this using the crisscross method. We can move the 3 over here, and then the 4, we can move that out here. Let's get rid of these. We do need to put parentheses around the phosphate, though, because it's a polyatomic ion, and we have four of them. So let's put parentheses around the phosphate. And this is the formula for lead 4 phosphate. Let's check our work. This one's a little bit more complicated than some of the other formulas. We know that lead had a 4 plus ionic charge, and the phosphate was 3 minus. We have a total of four phosphate ions. Each one's 3 minus. 4 times 3 minus, that's 12 minus. The leads, we have 3, each one's 4 plus. 3 times 4, that's 12 plus. So 12 plus and 12 minus, that adds up to 0. So this is the correct formula for lead 4 phosphate. Let's clean this up a little bit. And that's it, lead 4 phosphate, PB3. PO4-4. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.